Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. How, Good evening. Was, your, how was your long weekend? Excellent, teacher. Sure. <laughs> well, uh, I watched the the Independence Parade from El Salvador. It was good. I I especially like the one when the the little the little uh, vehicle that they use for for the engineering. The Comando de Ingeniería de la Fuerza Armada. I like how that man uses that little thing. Wow. And I also like when they when they make the uh, the simulation that when they had even helicopters and and um, drones. It was nice. I, I even uh, show it to my children and to my mother. <laughs> mm. I like the parade. Once I was in a parade and it was hard for me. Even drinking a lot of water while I was in the parade, I dehydrate. You are very quiet today. What happened? Nobody wants to tell me anything? What you have been doing this Four days. ¿Qué han estado haciendo estos cuatro días? One of you already resting, left. teacher. In my days. case, I was resting as much as I could. Okay. One of your uh, classmates already sent me the PPT, and it's okay. I hope you are working on that also. Besides the platform, okay? You have to look at the platform to know how you have to do the the, the report. Also you can you can use the the example I sent you. Okay, that example is for you to have um, an example and make your own work. Okay, but that, that one is very complete because it has most of the vocabulary used and most of the kind of sentences we had to use. Have you done anything uh, from the fourth uh, period? No? Let's start then. Almost time. Yes. Sharp. Now repeat after me. The biggest and the best. The biggest, the, the, best. the biggest and the best. The biggest, the biggest and, and the best. best. If you can't explain it, simply you don't understand it well enough. 
si no lo puedes explicar, simplemente no lo entiendes lo suficientemente bien. Albert Einstein. Section 4, the biggest and the best. Me hacen el favor y se mutean los que tienen gritos cerca, por favor. Gracias. Now, 4.0. Lesson objective. In this class, participants will learn new vocabulary related to geography. That's why I place here um, an earth glove. It's usually there's an earth glove here where you can see America. Okay, this is America, our continent. Imagine the Americans had only this piece of the ter territory. And Peter, sorry. Yes? I don't know, I don't know if it's, if it's just me, but I ah, guess you you're not see. sharing. Okay, wait, wait. You're not sharing your screen. Okay, maybe you are more than right. Let me see. And now? Yes, teacher. Okay, thank you. Now, in this class, participants will learn new vocabulary related to geography. Okay, this is the earth, and this is America. All this is America. And the so-called Americans only have this part of the territory. And they take out some territory from the Mexicans because this territory was Mexican before, okay? Americans were most just a piece of land here. And Canada had more land than United States of America. But you know that sometimes, uh, for example, Emiratos Arabes, did not help people from Peru, from El Salvador, from Honduras, and all that, because when we say that we are from America, they think we are from the United States, because the United States call themselves America, okay? And the ones from Emiratos didn't understand that that United States of America is only one of the countries from all the America. They think that all the America belongs to them. Okay, and that's why they say we don't need to help you because you are the most powerful country in the world. But nowadays with, with Nayib Bukele, Nayib Bukele went there and explained them that we are a different part and that the United States of America is just one country in North America. That, that was something that they didn't know. They, they didn't understand that. And, and I, I tell you because once I talked with, with a guy from Qatar, that worked from for for organizations that help poor people, but they only help poor people from Africa and Oceania. And I asked them, why don't you help also Latin America? 
And he say, well, because you 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 are one of the most powerful countries in the in the world. And I say no. And I explain him with with uh, the map, uh, the difference. And he say, we we didn't understand that that way. Well, we we are a different. We are many different countries here, and this is only one country. Okay. Now that's why now, if you notice, uh, Qatar and Emiratos are helping a little bit more Latin America because before they didn't know we don't belong to United States. Now we have vocabulary. Listen and repeat. Many times as needed. Uh, do you listen? Escucha? Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay. Yes, okay. Teacher. Beach. 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 Desert. 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 Well, if you notice desert. here, we have this is a desert and this is a beach. Okay. Beach. Beach. Both of them have a sun. Okay. But the difference is that this is in the middle of the of the continent, and this is uh, around the continent. Okay, eh, los desiertos están como a mediados mm -hmm. del continente, y las playas están alrededor del continente, verdad? Mm -hmm. Pero ambas tienen arena in our hat, okay? But sometimes in the desert at night, it's very, very, very cold. And that's why most of the people from the desert prefer to walk during the night and to rest during the day because during the day, it is too hot for you to be walking. Now. Forest. 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 Hill. Here. 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 Okay, Here. forest is where, where you have a lot of trees together. Okay, bosque. Here. And hill is when you have uh, some, some kind Here. of uh, mountain, but lower than a mountain. Okay, hill is colina. Okay. Mm -hmm. Island. 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 Okay. And now the other. Lake. 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 The difference between island and lake is well, island and lake are very similar. Island is a portion of land surrounded okay. by water. And a lake is a portion of water surrounded by land. Okay, mm -hmm. so almost the same, but the opposite. 
Okay, For island, a portion of land surrendered by water. And the water could be uh, fresh water or salty water. O sea, pueden haber islas tanto en, en el mar, ¿verdad? Que sería salty como water, como en, en, en los lagos, como en el Dilopango, por ejemplo, hay, hay, hay islas en medio del, del lago Dilopango. Ok, now, en lake is a piece of water surrendered by land. Ok. Mm -hmm. Mountain. 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 This, this is a schwa. Mountain. 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 Ocean. 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 River. 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 Valley. 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 Volcano. 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 Waterfall. 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 Este, en el trabajo que van a hacer, traten de utilizar lo más que puedan de este tipo de vocabulario, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Este y aquí hay más en este en este lesson objective podemos ver más este ge, eh, geography thing por ejemplo por ejemplo iceberg 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 The difference between the sea and the ocean is that the ocean is bigger, yes. okay? And the sea is smaller. For example, if you notice, uh, they call Mediterranean Sea, el mar Mediterráneo, mm -hmm. porque it's, it's a portion of the ocean, but it's, it's, it's smaller, okay? Now, uh, Fjord. 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 Lake. 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 Dream. 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 Esos son como riachuelos. Dream. 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 Con ese al principio. Dream. 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 Geyser. 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 Tundra. 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 Plateau. Plateau. Canyon. Canyon. Cave. Cave. Golf. Golf. River. River. Delta. 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 The delta of the river is where the river uh, gets into the ocean. Okay. Cuando el, el, el río entra al océano, that's the delta of the river. And mm -hmm. it spreads of different 
screen. Se, se, se divide en diferentes eh, arrochuelos. Oasis. 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 Desert. Desert. Dune. 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 Dune son las donas, las, eh, las dunas. Y las dunas, este, es lo más cambiante que tiene el desierto. O sea, algunas veces hay montículos en un lugar y otras veces hay montículos por otro lugar. O sea, son como, como pequeñas colinas. Pero como el desierto, el, el, el aire del desierto las mueve, ¿verdad? Entonces no son, no son como nuestras colinas, que la colina usted sabe que está ahí por su casa y ahí va a estar siempre, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. En cambio las dunas del desierto varían de un día para otro. Prairie. 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 Esa es pradera. Prairie. Cove. 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 Es similar al golfo, pero más pequeño. ¿Verdad? Cobb. Cobb. Y, y, y es más, más este, pronunciado que el Cape. O sea, el Cape y el Cobb se parecen. Pero eh, el Cape es como digamos... No, es abierto. Un poquito más abierto. Ajá, y el Cobb es, es un poquito más cerrado. O sea, digamos que la bahía de Jiquilisco podría ser un cop, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Que es como más cerradito. Mm -hmm. Now, ok, teacher. Archipélago. 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 That, that, that's a lot of, 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 of islands. And yeah. island. 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 Cliff. Cliff. Cliff es cuando se mira así como que fuera eh, este, como que fuera arrecife. parte de un cañón. Es un arrecife. Ajá. Cliff es un arrecife. Ismus. El ismo, por ejemplo, aquí en Panamá, eh, eh, Panamá es un ismo. El ismo. Forest. 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 Península. Península. Así como el que está, eh, eh, como el que está allá al principio de, de, del mar Mediterráneo, ¿verdad? Donde casi se une África con Europa. Ese es un estrecho. Swam. 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 Eso es, Swam. Este, es eh, ¿cómo se llama? Pantano. Swam. Jungle. 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 Lagoon. 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 Bueno, esos son básicamente las geography settings. Now, participants will listen to a conversation about geography. Comparisons with adjectives will first be introduced. Nos vamos a ir otro. Fíjense que para que se oyera mejor eh, eh, este, este este, ¿cómo se llama? La conversación. No, pues sí, pero este sticker, en lugar de utilizarlo con, con porque tiene, tiene un auxiliar, ¿verdad? Tiene un, ah, bueno. un cable auxiliar. En lugar de utilizarlo con cable auxiliar, mejor lo utilicé con Bluetooth y se oye mejor. Lo oyen mejor ustedes. Tú, señal digital, cable auxiliar, señal analógica. Es mejor lo digital, teacher. Ajá. Entonces, este... Pero yo no me acordaba que se podía hacer así. En eso, luchando con él, que hoy ni me funcionó el cable, 
dije yo, ah, no, si esto se puede hacer con, con, con Bluetooth. Y, y empecé a travesearlo hasta que lo logré. Hoy así lo voy a dejar. Excelente. Okay. Do you want to listen again? Do you want to listen no. again? No, se escuchó no, nada. Teacher, no. No le escucharon. No. No. Híjole. ¿Y qué varía ahora? Pues? No, por lo menos, teacher. Permítame. Hoy sí, no, teacher. no, sí, no, no, teacher. no se escuchó no. nadita, no, no. yet. No. Supuestamente no varía nada. Vamos a ver. Entonces, ese es problema ya con Zoom. Permítanme. Me avisan si oyen ahora. ¿Y ahora? ¿Escucharon algo? No. No, teacher. No. Vamos a ver. ¿Y me escuchan a mí? Sí. Yes, teacher. Vamos a ver ahora. ¿Ahí? Por el principio se oye. Ah, se oye. Vale. ¿Escucharon? No, teacher. Se no, no, teacher. Se escucha como que está bien al fondo allá. Mejor no practiquémoslo sé. con usted, teacher, porque si no... Bueno. Vale. Eh, se lo voy a leer primero. Vayan siguiendo la lectura. ¿Ok? Ok. ¿Me escuchan? Ok. Yes, Now, teacher. Here's a geography quiz in the paper. Oh, I love geography. Ask me the questions. Sure. First question. Which country is larger? China or Canada? 
I know Canada is larger than China. Okay, next. What's the longest river in the Americas? Mm, I think is the Mississippi. Here's a hard one. Which country is more crowded? Monaco or Singapore? I'm not sure. I think Monaco is more crowded. Okay, one more. Which South American capital city is the highest? La Paz. Quito or Bogota? Okay, that's easy. Bogota is the highest. Okay. Okay. Quito, Quito is Ecuador. La Paz is Bolivia. And Bogota is Colombia. Am I right? ¿O no se acuerdan ustedes? Yes, yes teacher. Yes, yes teacher. <laughs> de sus clases de geografía. You know one thing? Eh, in America, we, Salvadorians, are the ones that have the best eh, social studies eh, curriculum. Because we learn about the world. Most people only teach their country or the countries around them, but we learn about the world. And I like that because here in Panama, and, and if you notice, some people uh, in CNN or uh, TV Azteca, or whatever, they don't know about geography. Have you noticed once one woman said that Nicaragua was between between Ecuador and Peru? <laughs> Imagine they don't know geography as we do. I'm proud of El Salvador education. Now in ah, the United States wants us to lower our education because when, when we move from El Salvador to the United States, we get a higher level in education. That means that if you are about to go to sixth grade, they put you in seventh grade because you, you know more than the people from from United States and they don't like that. That's why they ask El Salvador people to lower uh, our, our educational system because they don't like that Latin American or Salvadorian students were wiser than their children. <laughs> they envy us. Now, repeat after me. Here's a geography quiz in the paper. Here's geography quiz in the paper. Oh, I love geography. Oh, I love geography. Ask me the questions. Ask, Ask me, me the question. question. Sure. First question. Sure. First question. First question. Which country is larger? Which, Which country, country is larger? larger? China or Canada? China, China or Canada. Canada. I know Canada is larger than China. I know, I know, I know Canada is larger than China. Than Canada. No, Canada <laughs> is larger than China. 
I know larger than China. Okay. Okay, next. Okay, next. Next. What's the longest river in the Americas? What is the longest river in the Americas? I think it's the Mississippi. I think it's the Mississippi. Here's a hard one. It's a hard one. Which country is more crowded? Which country is more crowded? Monaco or Singapore? Monaco or Singapore? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I think Monaco is more crowded. Monaco is more proud. Okay, one more. Okay, one more. Which South American capital city is the highest? Which South American capital city is the highest? La Paz. Quito. Quito or Bogota. Or Bogota. Okay, that's easy. Okay, that's easy. Bogota is the highest. Bogota is the highest. Okay, now you know. Volunteer. Ecuador. O quieren, o quieren repetir. ¿Se sienten ya listos para, para hacerlo en pareja? Yes, teacher. Yes, ok, yes. volunteer. Yes. Y teacher. Eh, Ana. Yes. Ok, ¿y who else? Y hey, teacher. José, ok, Ana en José. En Asterdad, Katia, ok. After, after Ana en José, Katia en Miguel Ángel. ¿Ok? Yes, teacher. Ok, go ahead. Uh, I'm Mike, right? Yes. Ok, here's a geography quiz in the paper. Oh, I love geography. Ask me the questions. Sure. First question. Which country is larger, China or Canada? I know Canada is larger than China. Oh, okay, next. What's the longest river in Americas? In mm, the Americas? Mm, I think it's the Mississippi. Here's a hard one. Which country is more crowded, Monaco or Singapore? I'm not sure. I think Monaco is more crowded. Okay, one more. Which South America capital city is the highest? La Paz, Quito, or Bogota? Okay, that's easy. Bogota is the highest. Okay, thank you very much. Welcome. Now, Miguel Angel and Ana. Katia, teacher. Yes, teacher. Ada. Katia. Katia, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Here is a geography quiz in the paper. Oh, I love geography. Ask me the question. Sure. First question which country is larger, China or Canada? I know Canada is larger than China. Next teacher. Okay, next. What's the longest a river in the Americas? Hmm. I think it's the Mississippi. Here is a hard one. 
which country is more crowded, Monaco or Singapore? I'm not sure. I think Monaco is more crowded. Okay, one more. Which your American capital city in the high? La Paz, Quito, or Bogota? Okay, that's easy. Bogota is the highest. Okay, thank you very much. You're welcome, thank you. teacher. Thank you. Okay, other two volunteers? Me? Okay. Uh, Elba Carolina, who else? Yeah. Eduardo, okay. Elba and Eduardo. After them, Daisy and who else? Who will go with Daisy? Well, uh, start uh, the first ones, please. Elba and... Okay. Okay. Here's, here's a geography quiz in the paper. Oh, I love geography. Ask me the question. Sure. First question, which country is larger, China or Canada? I know Canada is larger than China. Okay. Next. What's the longer river in the America? Mm, I think it's the Mississippi. Here, I have one. Which country is more crowded, Monaco or Singapore? When, sorry, I'm not sure. I think Monaco is more crowded. Okay. Elba. Elba. Yo creo que se frizó. Se tuvo que salir. Okay. One more. Which South American capital city is the highest? La Paz, Quito, or Bogota? Okay, that's easy. Bogota is the highest. Okay, thank you. Se nos fue Elba. Now, Daisy and... Mi teacher. Uh -huh. Who else? Okay, go ahead. Me okay. teacher. Okay, teacher. go ahead. Here's a geography quiz in the paper. Oh, I love geography. Ask me the question. Sure, first question. Which country is larger, China or Canada? China or Canada? I know Canada is larger than China. Okay, next, what's the largest river in these Americans? Mm, I think it's the Mississippi. Here's a hard one. Which country is more crowded, Monaco or Singapore? I'm not sure. I think Monaco is more crowded. Okay, one more. Which South America capital city is the highest, La Paz, Quito, or Bogota? Okay, that's easy. Bogota is the high, highest. Okay, thank you very much. If you notice, here we have different uh, ways to compare. Okay, when you say larger, it's Más grande. You are comparing just two things. China and Canada. Two things. Okay. And when you say 
uh, for example, more crowded, uh, you are talking about two things, Monaco and Singapore, okay, two countries. Mm -hmm. And when you say longest river, you are comparing more than two things because it's the longest river in the Americas. That means uh, in North America, South America, and Central America, okay? And here, when you say the highest, you are comparing three different cities, La Paz, Quito, and Bogota, okay? So, then you can... I'm sorry, teacher, for the disconnection. Pardon? Perdón. ¿Qué pasó? Pero, ah, que al fin regresó. Se la sí, 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 se sí. Primero se nos, la plataforma. se nos frizó, se nos quedó calladita y después la sacó. Pero no se preocupe, sí. ya la terminamos. <risa> yo, yo usurpé su puesto. Es que me imaginé que tuvo problemas, porque se vio que, que de repente se nos, se nos quedó calladita. ¿O, o quiere terminarlo? Oh, ok, está bien. No, pues no. Vaya, ¿en cuál íbamos? En esa, ¿verdad? I'm not sure. I think Monaco is more crowded. Usted era Mike, ¿no? Okay. okay, one more. Which should America capital city in the highest? La Paz, Quito, or Bogota? Okay, that's easy. Bogota is the highest. Okay, thank you very much. Now, uh, more volunteers? No? Bueno, vamos a terminar aquí y Me si nos da tiempo, regresamos. ¿Qué pasó? Mi, mi teacher. Mi teacher. Ah, ok. Marisol y Dina Elizabeth. Ok. Ok. Ok, Marisol first. Here's a geography quiz in the paper. Oh, I love geography. Ask me the questions. Sure. First question. Which country is larger? China or Canada? I know Canada is largest than China. Oh, next. What's the longest river in the Americas? Mm, I think is the Mississippi. Here's a hair one. Which country is more crowded, Monaco or Singapore? I'm not sure. I think Monaco is more crowding. Crowding. Crowded. Crowded. Okay. Crowded. One more. We so so American capital city is the highest. La Paz, Quito, or Bogota. Okay, that's easy. Bogota. Is the highest. 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 Okay, thank you very much. Any other volunteer? No volunteers? Okay. Let's continue. Now, in this uh, section, we are talking about adjectives. And uh, what is an adjective? An adjective is a word that tells you more about the size, shape, color, etc. of nouns. We put them before nouns. They do not have plural. For example, he is tall. She is tall. They are tall. In, in Spanish, Adjectives have plurals because you say 
Él es alto, ella es alta, ellos son altos. But in English, they don't have plural. Okay, the adjectives don't get plural. They are the same for singular and for plural. Okay, you don't have to change them. In Spanish, we have agreement for the adjectives. O sea, en español, nosotros sí hacemos plurales los, los adjetivos, pero en inglés no. Okay, now repeat after me. He is tall. He is tall. He is tall. He is tall. They are tall. They are tall. When we use an adjective, repeat. When we use an adjective, when we use an adjective, with a noun, with a noun, a noun, a noun, the adjective must must come before the noun. The adjective must come before the noun. Example. That is a large city. Si se fijan en esta oración, city es el nombre y large es el adjetivo. Entonces el, el, el adjetivo va antes que el nombre. Entonces, that is a large city. That is a large city. We visit a long river. We, we visit a long river. Entonces, river es el nombre y long es el adjetivo. Ok. Ok. Now, repeat after me. We form the comparative of adjectives meaning superior. We form the comparative. Sorry. We form the comparative of adjectives. Meaning superiority. We form the comparative with short adjectives. We short adjectives by adding R or ER. By adding R or ER. We use the word than. We use, use the word than after the adjective. After the adjective. 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 Entonces aquí están los ejemplos. Vaya, wide significa ancho. Okay. Wider than. O sea, aquí se está haciendo ya el, 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 el superior. O sea, el comparativo de superioridad. O sea, wider se le está agregando una R y se le está agregando además dan. Entonces, wider dan. Wider dan. Wider dan. Entonces, eso wider significa dan. más ancho que. ¿Qué? Más ancho que. ¿Ok? Now, tall. 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 Taller than. Taller than. Taller than. This river is wider than Lempa River. This river is wider than Lempa River. Lempa River. Okay. This reef is taller than the Eiffel Tower. This reef is taller than the Eiffel Tower. Entonces, eso es un arrecife. Eso es lo que está uh, eh, eh, debajo del océano. Es un arrecife. Normalmente son de coral. Okay. Now, eh, with adjectives ending in Y, with adjectives, adjectives ending y. in Y, With adjectives. With adjectives ending in Y. We change Y to I-E-R. 
Your city is prettier than mine. Your city is prettier than mine. That city is uglier than yours at night. That city is uglier than yours at night. Si se dan cuenta de esto que les estoy enseñando ahorita, son como este, reglas de formación de adjetivos, ¿verdad? Entonces, eh, sí. We duplicate the last consonant letter. We duplicate we the last du consonant letter. If a vowel sound is between two consonants. Fat. 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 Big, 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 Buddha's statue. Buddha's statue. Buddha's statue. Is fatter than Sancho's. Is fatter than Sancho's. Y lo pango lake. Lo pango lake. Is bigger than Guija lake. Is bigger than Guija lake. Eh, bueno, entonces hasta aquí eh, llegamos con lo que eran los comparativos, ¿verdad? Los comparativos, acuérdense que dijimos que se comparan dos cosas, ¿verdad? Entonces, los adjetivos simples se ocupan para describir cualquier cosa. Los Ajá. adjetivos comparativos, que son los que acabamos de ver, las tres reglas de formación, este, se utilizan con este comparando dos cosas este y hay superlativos que es cuando estamos comparando más de tres cosas o sea tres cosas o más entonces eh, siguen casi las mismas las mismas reglas que, que las otras, ¿verdad? Para los short adjectives, porque esto que estamos viendo, que se le agrega R o ER, es cuando el adjetivo es corto, porque cuando el adjetivo es largo, ya lo vamos a ver por ahí, eh, se pone more antes del adjetivo. O sea, que cuando el adjetivo es corto, se le agrega el sufijo, eh, se le agrega R o ER. Pero cuando es largo, se pone more, después el adjetivo y después dan. Por ejemplo, more beautiful than. La más bella que. Now, eh, we form the comparative of adjectives meaning superiority with short adjectives. With short adjectives. By adding ST or EST. By adding ST or EST. Mm, este, espérense. Superlativo. Hoy sí. Superlative of adjective.
Okay, now. ¿Están viendo o dejé de, de compartir? No, está bien, está bien. Estamos viendo, teacher. Okay. Now, eh, why the white dead? Why the white ah, Y the a white propósito, dead. ocupamos T-H-E, o sea, da, sé que es el o la, antes del adjetivo. El adjetivo. Acuérdense que el, el otro era that, dan, y lo ocupábamos al final. Este uh -huh. ocupamos da y lo ocupamos al principio. Entonces, why the widest? Why the widest? El más ancho, o sea, ancho, el más ancho, the widest. Tall, the tallest. Tall, the tallest. This river is the widest. This river is the widest. The widest. This reef is the tallest. This, this reef is the tallest. With adjectives ending in Y, we change the Y to I and add EST. Example, pretty. Pretty. The prettiest. The prettiest. Ugly. Ugly. The ugliest. The ugliest. Your city is the prettiest. Your, Your city, city is the prettiest. That city is the ugliest. That, that city, city is, the is the ugliest. We duplicate the last consonant letter. We duplicate the last consonant If a vowel sound is between two consonants. If a vowel sound is between two consonants. And then add EST. And then add EST. Pat the fastest. Pat the fastest. Fates. Fates. Sí, es que alguien me dijo por ahí el más, más rápido y ese solo es rápido y furioso. Ese no, es Fates, el más gordo. <risa> big, the biggest. Big, the biggest. Big, the biggest. Big, the biggest. Buddha's statue is the fates. Caspian Sea is the biggest. Caspian Sea is the biggest lake. The biggest lake. The biggest lake. The biggest lake. Yo no sabía que el mar Caspio era un lago. El mar Caspio. Pero le dicen mar y no es salado. O sea, es, 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 es agua dulce. Uh -huh. A pesar de que le dicen mar, se le dicen mar por lo grande, pero no es salado. Uh -huh. uh -huh. With long adjectives, okay, con, eh, eh, aquí están los, los, los adjetivos largos que yo les decía. We, eh, repeat after me. We form the comparative adjectives. We form, We form the comparative, comparative adjectives. adjectives. Meaning superiority. Meaning With long adjectives. With long adjectives. By using the word more before the adjective. By using the word more before the adjective. Then we write the word done after the adjective. And we write the, the word and the adjective. Sample. Sample. San Salvador City is more beautiful than Santa Ana City. Aquí me van a matar algunos. Pero era San Salvador City. San Salvador City is more beautiful than Santa Ana City. 
Bueno, les voy a decir que hubo un tiempo que Santa Ana, la ciudad de Santa Ana estuvo más bonita que la ciudad de San Salvador, ¿verdad? Porque San Salvador estaba pero horrible, toda llena, llena de, de no se podía ni caminar, pero hoy ya San Salvador ya está regresando a su belleza. Ok, New York City is more expensive than Denver. New York is more expensive than Entonces nos vamos a quedar hasta aquí y vamos a continuar mañana. Pero este, okay. esto, si ustedes ya empezaron a ver lo de la plataforma, se podrán dar cuenta que esto yo se los estoy poniendo de más. Esto no lo tienen en la plataforma, pero ustedes ya lo van a tener porque yo siempre les comparto los PPT. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Thanks, teacher. Thanks, teacher. Eh, see you tomorrow. Uh, see, see you tomorrow. Thank you. Ah, teacher, remember, see you tomorrow. Remember. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Remember, remember that this week we are going to study up to Friday. No vayan a hacer, no vayan a hacer este número de que van a ir a bailar el viernes, no. Van a bailar el viernes de la semana pasada. Okay. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night, teacher.